Wolfhound Lovers. My name is Shauna Stone and I am here to hopefully help. Um, you've joined our grooming and showing your wolfhounds group. It's not just for people who are showing though. It is also for people who just want to learn a little bit more about how to groom their wolfhounds. Um, you will see lower down on the page I recommend another wolfhound page for uh, Irish wolfhound grooming. There's a lot of good information there so definitely go there as well. I just want to be an additional resource in addition to that one. Um, so definitely take a peek at that one because they've got a lot of good videos and tips and tricks. So um, speaking of resources, we're going to start with some stuff that you should have in your library. One of them is The Irish Wolfhound by Mary McBride. This is considered the Irish Wolfhound Bible. I highly recommend that you get it. It is, however, out of print, so you will need to probably find it on eBay or a used book uh, finding resource. You can usually find it on eBay for anywhere from $100 to $150, but if you're patient, you can find it for under $100. Just set up an alert so that it will alert you when there's one that comes up and then you can decide if you want to buy it. The next one I recommend is this uh, Irish Wolfhound by Joel Samaha. He is a, a judge and obviously Wolfhound breeder and lover and this is a good resource as well. Um, harder to find, I believe it's out of print. Again, eBay, sometimes on Amazon you can find used books through them as well so that's not a bad idea. Um, a third is uh, Raising, Showing, and Breeding the Irish Wolfhound by Elizabeth Murphy. Great book to have as well. Um, all about health and other information you're going to want to have about your wolfhound. So, that. Um, in addition to having your mentors and people in your club that you talk to, I highly recommend that you definitely join our parent club, Irish Wolfhound Club of America. Um, the price of membership is about $30, and that alone, um, you will get... Harp and Hound. This magazine is a huge resource. Besides great articles and tips, um, there's a lot of good pictures. So if you're looking to figure out how to groom your wolfhound, there's pictures of winner's photos. These should be a guide. Don't groom your wolfhound just to make him look like so-and-so's dog, but you can get some good ideas about how your wolfhound should look. You can see how he, she's got her dog nice tr and trimmed on the belly. You can see how she's got her hound's head groomed. And you can also see, this is spring of 2018, so we should have some results in here from the previous specialties. So you can see who is doing what and why the judge liked that particular dog. This is a great way to learn about showing is by reading these judges summaries. Everybody has an opinion and that's what you're paying your, the judge for, but this this is priceless information. Highly recommend. It's Harp and Hound. It comes with your IWCA membership. Um, if you're not sure how to join, if you haven't heard of it, send me a PM. I will hook you up. So, um, again, not an expert, just another resource. Always be learning. Um, look for people to talk to, whether it's at a show after they're done in the ring or other people in your club. There's a lot of great people in this club and the lovers of wolfhounds that will help you out if you ask. If you run into somebody that maybe not having a good day and doesn't want to be helpful, just move on to the next person. Um, be like your wolfhound and pass it on. Once you've learned something, help the next person coming along. That's my goal. Um, if you have any questions, let me know. And we're going to move on next to stripping and rolling your Irish Wolfhound's coat.